Hello, hello, hello. Good evening, good evening. Hello, can you hear me? Yes, teacher. Hello. Good evening, nice. yes. Good Thank evening. you. Welcome, welcome. Good evening, good evening. So we are going to start uh, today. Let's see, let's see. Thank you for being on time. We are 13 participants right now. So probably the rest, uh, they are joining the meeting. And uh, we are going to start, okay? We are going to start. So I guess that we all were here yesterday, I hope so, okay? So what we are going to do today is um, continue with the lesson number four. And uh, let's see, let's see, Noemi Yesenia, what day is today? Noemi Yesenia, what day is today? Today is... Wednesday, September, September Wednesday, uh, 7th. Okay. <laughs> today, okay, today is Wednesday or Tuesday? I, Tuesday. <laughs> My goodness, Noem, you are in advance. <laughs> I was living in, in other things. Okay, no problem, no problem, uh, Noemi. Let's see, Chrysia, the same question, Chrysia. Uh, Chrysia Munoz, it says right there. What day is today? Tuesday. Okay, today is a Tuesday. Perfect, okay. So if I ask you what day is today, so today is Tuesday, right? But if I ask you, what's today date? Let's see, Alexandra Marroquin, what's today date? If I ask you that question, what's today date? September 3rd. <laughs> uh-huh, Alexandra Marroquin. Uh, September 17th, uh, uh, 7th. Okay, okay, yeah. When we ask for what uh, what's today date, in Spanish we say, que fecha es hoy, right? So what day is today? Que día es hoy? What day is today? But what's today date? Que fecha. Okay, what's today date? Que fecha, okay? Today is September the 7th. Okay, remember in this case we use the Ordinal numbers, right? So seventh with TH at the end. Okay, so today date is, ahí sería the correct answer. Today day is uh, September the 7th. Okay, nice. Thank you, Alexander Marroquin. Nice, perfect. So, uh, yeah, remember what's the, what is, uh, what day is today? So today is Wednesday. What's today day? The, the fecha, right? So we are asking for the date. Nice. Uh, let's see, Florence. Florence Megaña, were you here yesterday? Yes, right? Yes, teacher. Perfect, Florence. Um, how are you, Florence? I'm very well, teacher. Okay, thank you. Nice, okay. Thank you for being on time. Thank you for the cameras. Okay, for the ones that are using the camera, remember, uh, it's one of the rules, right? It's one of the rules to be with camera on because um, we need to see each other, okay? If you just put your name right there, so I'm not able to see your faces, okay? Thank you, Claudia Maria, for the camera, okay? Nice. I see your cat right there in the back. <laughs> nice, okay? So we are going to start today with the descriptions, okay? So did you remember some words that we learned from yesterday? Let's see, Armando Antonio. Armando Antonio, tell me any new work from the vocabulary that we learned yesterday about describing people. Did you remember? Hello, hello, good evening. Good evening. And yesterday, the vocabulary is and describe the person uh, now, boy, age, mouth, 
Eu. Different. Okay. Different, different nice. Okay. We mentioned details how to dis describe someone, right? Describe a person, describe uh, how the, the, the way that person is. Okay. So what we can see. Nice. Okay. Thank you, Armando. Uh, let's see. Karina, Lisette. Do you remember any word from yesterday from the picture that we were, you know, working about the describing people? Yes. Uh, big nose, brown eyes, thin, fat, uh, big round eye. Um, Face long. Long face. Long okay. face. Long face. Long uh -huh. face. Okay. Nice, Karina. Thank you. Mm -hmm. And let's see. One more. Let's see. For the ones that have pictures, okay? So the ones that I don't see pictures, please turn it on. Andrea, Jose Walter, Vanessa, Marina. I don't see your cameras. Please. Okay, so let's see, uh, Yolanda, Yolanda, hello, Yolanda, how are you? Fine, teacher. Nice. Uh, did you remember any new work or something from yesterday about describing yes. people? Clump. <laughs> ah, okay, that was something new, right? So we yes. were like, I don't know what it is, okay? Nice, thank you, okay. thank you. Okay, let's see. Thank you, Andrea. Thank you, Vane, for the camera. Welcome, Dagoberto, to the class. Welcome, Elvis. Nice to see you one more time, Rafael. There you go. So thank you. Now we are 19 in the meeting. Perfect. So let's see, Elvis, did you learn something new yesterday? Do you Did you learn any new work or something new? Hey. Uh, so, so teacher, uh, I remember that the mm -hmm. uh, the describe the the face, um, the nose and tongue and I and hand um, the people think. Okay, nice, Elvin. Thank yes. you, Elvis. Elvis, thank you. Nice. Okay, look, we have the picture right here. Okay, so let's see. Let's see who. Um, uh, Rafael, Rafael. Uh, let's see, Rafael. So used at least three or five, between three to five words to describe yourself. Okay, describe yourself. You can choose your age your eyes, your build, height, face, ears, mouth, or the lips or your nose, okay, so. Okay, okay. Um, I have a uh, black hair. Um, uh, I am middle age. I have uh, a mustache and barba. Beer, you have a beer? Yeah, beer. I see, that's why I told you because you have uh, many things that you can describe it just in your face. You have a beer, you have mouth mustache. Right. I one more, a, one more. A, a, um, brown eyes. Okay. Nice, uh, Rafael, thank you, nice. Let's see, let's see one more, let's see. Uh, Claudia Maria, with your cat in the back. <laughs> Claudia, ha, describe yourself, choose between three to five, okay? So that you can use to describe yourself. Yeah, okay, um, I'm young. <laughs> Okay, you are. I'm tall. Um, I have brown eyes. Um, I have 
oval face. Okay. And um, I have oval eyes. Okay, okay, oval eyes. Okay. So you can probably you I guess you have long hair as well. Long hair straight okay so uh el cabello no aparece aquí o si no right so we have also we can describe how it's the the color if you are blondy if you have black hair long hair how do you say ondulado cabello ondulado how do you say cabello ondulado curly sorry okay. no I'm... curly curly that would be colocho colochito curly but if you are not curly and you are not straight, straight is liso. Mm -hmm. So, no es ni liso ni colocho. How we say that? Wavy. Wavy, okay. Can be ondulado, dice. Well, Tiene el cabello ondulado. Wavy, okay. So, then we have a short hair, long hair. So, then you can mention the color. If you have blondy, if you are red red, uh, red hair, brown, black, and, and so on, okay? Perfect, thank you. Let's see, Vanessa, Vanessa de Los Angeles, go ahead. Could you please describe yourself? Choose between three to five words to describe yourself. Okay, teacher. Um, I have uh, oval face. And I I am young. I have thin lips and I have brown eyes and oval eyes. Okay. And I am tall. <laughs> okay, you are tall. Okay, Thank perfect. Thank you. Let's see one more, Dagoberto Rodriguez. Welcome, Dagoberto. Thank you for your camera. And you, the same story, Dagoberto, choose between three to five words to describe yourself, please. Hi, good evening. evening. Uh, I'm, I'm an old man. Uh, I have a white uh, hair. Uh, my hair are, are larger, it's okay. Large, large. large. I have large ears. I have a long face and my voice is thin. Okay, okay, Dagoberto, nice. Okay, so large, okay, large. That is the correct pronunciation, large. Okay. Teacher. Yes, Yolanda. Uh, how do you say uh, canoso? Mm, that would be like great, great hair, great hair. So that would be, or you can mix, right? You have when it's like great and black, so right here. Nice. Okay, so do we have any other volunteer? Algún otro que quiera participar? describing yourself. Cesar, welcome. Marina, thank you for the camera. Patricia, nice. Okay, now I see your faces. And I don't know if we have any other volunteer. I guess, yes. Let's see who. I saw a hands up, pero ya no veo quien levantó la mano. Me, teacher. Ah, okay, so Cesar, go ahead. Cesar and then Patricia. And then we have Andrea. Thank you, Lillian, Yolanda, Karina, nice. So Cesar, go ahead, describe yourself really quick. Thank you, my age, middle age. My I, and in that case, I am, a young middle age. Okay, a young middle age. Mm -hmm. A young middle age. I am fat. <laughs> I am medium age. Uh, my nose is a strange nose. Okay. My eye, my eyes are light brown eyes. My face is oval. My lips is full lips. Okay, curved lips. I am, I am less 
mall. I am large ears or big ears. <laughs> yeah, in that case, okay. In that case, I have, right? I have large mouth, mouth. Okay, mouth. Yeah. Look at, listen the pronunciation. No mouth, así no mouth. mouth. You need to, that word air ends with a TH. Okay, all the words that ends with a TH, you need to do like this, mouth. Mouth. Like if you are pointing, tiene que sacar un poquito la lengüita. Okay, si no la saca un poquito, no le sale el sonido. Okay, está un mouth. poco raro, pero, pero así es, mouth. Mouth. Ah, there mouth. you go, there you go, mouth. Porque si usted me dice así, mouth no es, okay? So, mouth, perfect. Thank you. Nice, Thank you. sister, nice, okay? Let's see, now we have Patricia, then we have Andrea, then we have Lillian, Karina, okay? So, Patricia, go ahead. Hello, good evening. Good evening. Um, I have curly hair. I have small ears. I have an oval face. I am of medium age. Um, I have big uh, eyes and I am middle age. Okay, middle age, middle age. Okay, thank you, Patricia, nice. Let's see, we have Andrea and then we have Lillian and then we have Karina, okay? So go ahead, Andrea. Okay, um, I am a small person. She lives in a small mom, uh, a slated age, a strain and a medium black hair. And I am white. And white skin and white skin and wear oval. Uh, I am a young person uh, and I am a small earth. That's it. Okay, okay, perfect, Andrea. So nice. Remember um, when we are going to describe something that we are not able to like to count, it's I am, right? I am middle age, okay? But now if you want to say just tengo, right? So in that case, we will say I have, I have long face, okay? I am middle age, I am plump, I am, I am fat, I am tall, okay? So then if we can say something that we have, yeah, that means I have blue eyes, like I have big nose, I have uh, full lips, okay? Nice, thank you, Andrea. Uh, let's see, now we have uh, Lillian and then we have Karina, go okay. ahead. Okay, I have oval face. I have a small eyes. I have large mouth. Mouth, okay, mouth. look, mouth, mouth. Mouth. Mm -hmm. um, a young, medium, a. Mm -hmm. That would be uh, middle, middle age, middle age. Okay, middle, middle, middle age. Middle mm -hmm. age, a young middle age. Mm -hmm. yep. uh, um, I am put uh, will. Okay, this one will wilt wilt. Mm -hmm. Wilt. Okay. Um. Um. I am. I have. A medium age. Estaría bien así la pronunciación. A young middle age. Okay, yeah. Okay. Perfect. Thank you, Lillian. Nice. Now we have Karina. Go ahead, Karina Lisette. Okay. I wear glasses. I'm a middle age. Uh, my my eyes. I have small eyes. I have a small mouth. I have a thin lips. I 
I have oval face. Okay. I, uh, okay, yes. thank you, Karina. Okay, so I have thin lips, okay? Thin lips. So if we say I have a, mm, that sounds weird, okay? I have a, no, I have thin lips, okay? Forget the a. Okay, but nice. Thank you, Karina. Let's continue, okay? Oh my goodness, time is flying, okay? So we need to continue, okay? I know that we want to continue describing ourselves, but we will do something, okay? Uh, let's see, let's see who. Um, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Hi. Go ahead, thank you. Uh, let's see, uh, help me with the reading, okay? Read the objective that we have right here in the screen, please. Um, negative, objective negative. In this section, particip participants will listen to the conversation between two people describing another person. Adjective of apparency will be practiced. Thank you. Nice. The conversation. It's perfect. Okay. We will see that right here. So in this section, participants will listen to a conversation between two people describing another person. Okay. Adjectives of appearance will be practiced. Okay. So the appearance, that's what we are talking, right? So how we can describe someone. Oh, he is funny. Uh, he's tall, he's short, he's fat, and so on. So we will see some adjectives, okay? So um, let me share right, right here one more time the uh, screen because I need to share the, um, the sound as well. So let me share it right here. There we go. And... Um, Okay, just a moment. Let me see right here. Oh my God, it got closed. So we will, we are going to listen this conversation and we are going to practice. So at this part, at this point, so since we are pre-intermedial, so listening is very important listening skills i guess that you know that we have four um we have four skills in english right so we have four skills besides um talking we have listening listening is very 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 important okay for you to uh, be able to understand okay sometimes when we are in the intermediate level it happens that we say, yes, teacher, I'm able to understand everything that you are talking about, okay? It is very clear for me. But then, as soon as you listen, like a conversation, everything change, okay? So when we listen to um, a, a conversation, so everything change. This is something that we covered already with the... With the with the last picture, but this is what we are going to see. We are going to listen to this conversation between uh, day two and it says the name of the conversation is, she is very tall. So at this point, I don't know if you listen to English besides being in the class, be honest. Alguien toma alguna otra eh, refuerzo de inglés o solamente la clase? Be honest. Just the class? Only class. Only the class. I, I understand. Class. I understand because you have a job, right? So ustedes no son personas que no hacen nada. So you are a busy, busy, busy person the whole day, right? And it is kind of complicated, but my best advice is listen to music in English. Watch TV in English. And um, something that you can do and let's see, let me, let me ask you, okay? Because we are in intermediate. So estamos ya llegando a un nivel intermedio. Usted tiene que eh, escuchar el inglés un poco más intenso que lo, al inicio, when we are at the beginning, right? Beginners. So usted tiene que escuchar el inglés, no solo en la clase. Y a veces uno dice, pero es que yo no tengo tiempo. 
pero sí tenemos tiempo para ver el teléfono, para ver social media, right? So Facebook, Instagram, whatever we used. Uh, WhatsApp, nadie me puede decir aquí, no, yo ni el WhatsApp veo. Mm, you use WhatsApp the whole day because of your job, because of your business, because of your family, because of your friends. So we are on WhatsApp many, many hours. So let me ask you, let's see, vamos a hacer una interview aquí. Uh, let's see, Alexander Marroquín, be honest. I, you do have a phone, right? We all have smartphones. Yo no creo que alguien me vaya a decir aquí, yo tengo un gran ladrillo que no agarra internet. No, we all, we have smartphones and you have some expensive and nice phones. So Alexander, the, your phone is in English or in Spanish? Uh, Alexander Marroquín. Uh, now my phone is in Spanish, teacher. Why it in Spanish? Let's see, let's see. Noemi, Yesenia, what about you? Your phone is in English or in Spanish? Currently, I have my phone in Spanish, but sometimes ago, I have my phone in English. Uh -huh. Why you switch it? So keep it in English. Let's see, Dagoberto, what about you, Dagoberto? Your phone, the language on your phone is in English or it is in Spanish? Uh, the language in my cell phone is Spanish. Uh -huh. Rafael, what about you, Rafael? It's in Spanish. Oh my goodness, Cesar, what about you, Cesar? Uh, my phone in English. Uh, but uh, read in Spanish the most uh, feel feel the English. Uh, I'll uh, I just big notices. Uh, okay. I I found the music. I the practice in the main I for. <laughs> okay, uh, but uh, but if you have your phone in English, so that is something nice. In Let's English. see. Armando Antonio, what about you, Armando Antonio? Your phone is in English or in Spanish, Armando, be honest. Oh, it's in Spanish. Spanish, oh my Spanish. goodness, yeah. but we are in intermediate, okay? It's so sure. homework, homework, it's Milagro, what about you, Milagro, mira? Your phone is in English or in Spanish, Milagro? So you are on mute, but I, hear, I see your lips that says Spanish. <laughs> Uh -huh. Richard, can I say something? Go ahead. Go ahead. Uh, 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 my phone is, is in Spanish, but uh, I work uh, with computers, and, and uh, the most of the time, uh, the computers uh, are uh, Windows with, uh, with the language in English. Uh, so mm -hmm. I, I, I. You learn I many words. It. You learn little. many <laughs> words in English, okay? So yeah. homework, and this is not a homework that will be evaluated. So, but we are in intermediate levels. So we need to learn, we need to improve the vocabulary. Please change the language in your phone. You go to settings in your phone, and on settings, you have an option right there that says languages, okay? Ajustes en español, ahí dice lenguaje. Y ahí lo va a tener usted que cambiar a inglés. And everything will be changed into English. Y ahí me van a decir, ay, esta teacher, por ahí no entiendo qué me están diciendo aquí. No hay dónde encontrar las cosas en el teléfono, va a decir usted. But that will be at the beginning. Eso va a ser al inicio. Then you will learn many, many, many new words. Okay? Since we are in WhatsApp, porque les aseguro que todos pasan en WhatsApp cierto tiempo o a cada rato que alguien le manda un texto, un message, lo que sea, right? We are in many groups. En el trabajo estamos en el grupo de los cheros, en el del grupo de los amigos, en la, los grupos de los deportes, so, grupo de los papás, grupo. Híjole, we are on many groups, ¿ok? Yes, so, why don't we change the language, ¿ok? Do it. Tal vez no lo haga, vaya, le doy permiso, pero during the weekend, que usted no está, digamos, trabajando, para los que no trabajan, cambien el lenguaje. Por ejemplo, cuando usted está conectado en el WhatsApp, ahí dice, usted dice, ah, está conectado, dice en línea, right, in Spanish. 
So do you know how to say that in English? Online. Online. Oh. Perfect. Entonces usted ya no me va a decir, ah, mire, fulano está en línea. Usted me va a decir, oh, he is online. Means that he's connected right now on WhatsApp. So when you receive a call, when you receive a call, you will see incoming call. You will see incoming call, llamada entrante. Incoming what, call. What, what is pronunciation DVD or in WhatsApp and write? It's typing. Ah, typing. 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 Perfect. Okay. Right, cuando right. alguien está escribiendo, ahí aparece. Ahí dice que está, cuando usted ve que alguien está escribiendo, usted puede ver o oh, está grabando un audio. Voice recorder va a decir ahí. Typing. Voice recorder. So, imagínense, usted va a aprender, pero miles de palabras solo en el WhatsApp. Solo está teniendo su teléfono en English. So when you go to Facebook, ya no le va a dar me gusta, sino que le va a tener que dar like. Ok, ya no le va a decir ahí el Instagram uh, siguiendo, sino que le va a decir following. Ok, so you see, FYI, este es un paréntesis que me estoy tomando el tiempo aquí de aconsejarles algo bueno definitivamente. You are intermedial. Ok, so at the beginning, primeros meses de inglés, es un poco más complicado, pero in your level, you need to do it, ok, you need to go into advanced level, in order for you to achieve that and be on the advanced, so you need to do your best right now that you are in the intermediate, ok, so al final, el último día de clases, le voy a preguntar si cambiaron el lenguaje de su phone, ok, So, let's continue, okay? Let's continue. Let's see, we are going to listen this conversation, okay? Let's pay attention and then we will see if we can ask some questions, okay? Let's see. Hello to all. In this lesson, you will listen to a conversation between two people describing another person. Adjectives of appearance will be practiced. I hear you have a new girlfriend, Randy. Yes, her name's Ashley and she's gorgeous. Really? What does she look like? Well, she's very tall. How tall? About six feet two, I suppose. Wow, that is tall. What color is her hair? She has beautiful red hair. And how old is she? I don't know. She won't tell me. Okay, nice. This is a small um, conversation that we have right here. Okay, so this is a conversation that it's, uh, she's very tall. Okay, it says, I hear you have a new girlfriend, Randy. Yes, her name's Ashley and she's gorgeous. What is gorgeous? What is that? Precioso. Aha, uh -huh. it's more than beautiful, right? Beautiful, it's beautiful, but it's more than beautiful. It's so beautiful, okay? So gorgeous. Really, what does she look like? What does she look like? If I ask you, what does you look like? Le estoy preguntando cómo es, right? La apariencia, cómo es ella? What does she look like? Cómo es ella? Well, she is very tall. How tall? About six feet two. Imagine, dos pies y, y dos, okay? Dos pies y, 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 y un dos, right? So, I supposed, wow, that is tall. What color is her hair? She has a beautiful red hair, okay? She has a beautiful red hair. And how old is she? I don't know, she won't tell me, okay? So let's see, let's see if we can practice this conversation, okay? Uh, let's see, Marina Sanabria, okay? Marina, you are going to be Emily. And let's see, Luis Alonso, you are going to be Randy, okay? So go ahead, uh, Luis Alonso, and also Marina, go ahead. Okay. I hear you had a new girlfriend, Randy. Uh, yes, her name's Ashley, and she's gorgeous. Really? What does she look like? 
Well, she's very tall. How tall? About uh, six feet two, I suppose. Wow, that is tall. What color is her her hair hair hair? She has beautiful red hair. And how old is she? <clears throat> I don't know. She won't tell me. Okay, thank you. Okay, nice. Uh, girlfriend, girlfriend. I heard you have a new girlfriend. Okay, and this one yeah, right here. Let me see. Uh, I don't, I'm not pointing. Oh, yes, right here. So uh, her names, this letter S, we need to pronounce it, okay? No hay que obviar que aquí está el verb to be. Because it is, if I say yes, her name, Ashley, ahí falta algo. So even though the, we have an apostrophe right here, we need to, we need to pronounce it. Uh, her names... Her name's Ashley, okay? Remember, pro correct pronunciation, right? Um, then what else we have right here? I supposed, I supposed, hair, 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 okay? Nice. Let's see, we have time just for one more, okay? Time is so short for us, okay? Uh, let's see. Let's see, uh, let's see, uh, Milagro, Milagro, you are going to be Emily, okay? And Mauricio Morales, you will be Randy, okay? So go ahead, Emily and Mauricio. Okay. Hi, I heard you have a new here friend, Randy. Mauricio, go ahead. You are on mute, Mauricio, I'm sorry. Yeah, sorry. Go ahead. Uh, uh, yes, her name's Ashley, and she is gorgeous. Really? What does she look like? Well, she's very tall. How tall? Uh, about six, six feet. Six feet two, I suppose. Wow, that is tall. What color is the hair high? Uh, she has a beautiful red hair. And how old is she? Uh, I don't know. I don't have time to ask her. Okay. <laughs> she won't tell me. I don't know. She won't tell me. Okay, thank you, Mauricio. Nice. Okay, perfect. Tall. Okay. Wow, she's tall. Tall. Okay. Nice. Let's continue because of the time we have to continue. Okay. Let me let me uh, continue with the presentation right here, and we will do something different. Okay. So let's see. What about you? Okay. What about you? So in this case, please. Answer these questions, okay? So answer these questions about you. And then we are going to ask the questions to somebody else, okay? Let's see, what about you? Uh, what is your height now? Do you know what is your height? Let's see, let's see who, veamos a quien no le he preguntado. Los que no tienen cámara no los veo. Uh, let's see, let's see, Caesar. What is your uh, hey, uh, your height now? I have medium height. Okay, and do you know uh, exactly uh, um, what is your height? Like one uh, meter. Okay, my my mirror is. Uh, are going to hunter more than hunter pong very very long okay okay nice Caesar so try to answer these questions okay try to answer these questions about you what color are your eyes 
What color is your hair? Uh, how long is your hair? Uh, what is your nose like? And what is your face? Okay, so try to answer those questions about you. Okay, and then we are going to ask the questions to our classmates, okay? You have just one or two minutes to answer those questions, okay? Go ahead and do it now, please. Uh, every time. Yeah, I don't know if you are writing down the answer. If you have the chance to write it down, your answers will be nice, okay? okay. If you need, if you need the, if you need the, the previous picture, this one, for the vocabulary, we have it here. Okay, so it's asking you, it's ask you about your height, it's ask you about your eyes, it asks you about your hair, about your nose. Okay, so we need to answer about you, and then we will see what happened with the your best friend, how you can describe your uh, husband, your wife, your son, your daughter. Hey, okay. Elvis Abrego. What color are your eyes? Okay, so just just let's just a moment. Okay, just give me one moment, sister. I guess that he is writing down the answers. Okay, one more minute. Okay, be ready with the answers because we are going to start the questions with uh, the group. Just a moment, sister. I'm sorry. Hello. Yep. I question or answer. Yeah, we are going to share the questions, okay? I guess that we are ready now, okay? I don't know if you finish your answers. Yes, we finish with the answers or no? No, yes? Uh, I don't know. Okay, yes. so you finish? Perfect. How do you say aún no? Cuando usted le dice, mire, ya terminó de hacer lo que estaba haciendo, usted dice, no, aún no, not how you, not yet, okay? Oh, so yeah. that would be not yet, okay? So do we finish with all the answer, yes or no? Brown, your hair brown too. How do you spell brown, teacher? Brown, that will uh -huh. be B-R-O-U-N. Brown, the color brown. Right. Okay. Perfect. So let's see, sister, since you are the volunteer, go ahead, choose one of your classmates and ask the first question, okay? Go ahead, sister. Uh, continue on the question. Yeah, the first one, this one. Choose one of your classmates and ask the question number one, this one. Okay. Um, Flores Magaña, what is your hair No. Okay. So who, Flores? My hair is one meter, 66 centimeters. Nice, okay, one meter 66. Okay, you are kind of tall. <laughs> nice, okay, so now Florence, choose somebody else, one of your classmates and ask the second question. Uh, another person or? Rafael. No, in that case is Florence, okay? Florence, you say Rafael. So go ahead, Florence, with your question. What color are your eyes? Okay, Rafael. My eyes are brown. Perfect, thank you. Now, Rafael, choose somebody else with the third question. Karina Marisol. Okay, Karina. Okay. What color is your hair? My hair is brown. 
Nice, okay. Perfect, so now Karina, go ahead and choose somebody else. Karina, Karina. Vanessa. Okay. How long is your hair? Um, my hair is short. Okay, my hair is short or I have short hair. I have, I short, have hair. short hair. Okay, nice. Uh, Bunny, choose somebody else with the next question. Mm. Andrea Sosa. Okay, Andrea. Uh -huh. okay. Andrea Sosa. Um, what color are your eyes? Uh, my eye is brown. My eyes is or are, Andrea? My, uh, my eyes are brown. Ah, okay, my uh, eyes are, are perfect, are brown. Nice. So, Andrea, now choose somebody else, okay? Esos que no, no hemos preguntado, hay que preguntarles. Okay, um, Mr. Walter Vasquez. Okay, Walter, go ahead with your question, yeah. Andrea. What is your nose like? Okay, Walter, Jose Walter, I guess. My, my, my nose is long. Okay, so we don't see it, Walter. What is, what happened with your camera, Walter? I don't see your face. Okay, so Walter, now choose somebody else, okay? Choose somebody else with the, ne the next question. Okay. Nice, now we see you, Walter, nice. Mm. Okay, perfect. Now choose somebody else, Walter. Okay. Oh, Milagro, mira. Okay, Hello. Milagro. What color is your hair? My hair is color black okay my hair is a black or black color okay mm -hmm. nice now milagro choose somebody else with another question don armando okay armando what is your face okay I'm sorry, what one more time. What is your face? My face is a square. A square, okay, square. square. My face is a square. Okay, perfect. So now we are going to change a little bit of the equations, okay? Now, instead of us uh, about you, we are going to ask about somebody else. As an example, let's see, let's see, as an example, let's see for, um, let's see, Noemi, Yesenia, Noemi, Yesenia, uh, how long is your uh, mother here? How long is your mother here? Okay. Um. My mother has a long hair. Okay, my mom has long hair. Perfect, we are going to use different pronouns, right? Because now we are not talking about me. We are talking about somebody else, okay? So let's see, Yolanda. Yolanda, how, uh, let's see, what is your husband knows like? What is your husband knows like? Uh, his, uh, his nose is uh, long. Okay, his nose is long or he has long oh, nose. Has okay. Long nose. Perfect. Uh, Luis Alonso. Luis Alonso. Do you have sisters, Luis Alonso? I don't hear teacher. 
Ah, okay. Do you have sisters? Yes or no? Sisters. Yes, yes, teacher. Okay. Yes, one, I do, one right? Sister. Okay, I have one sister. Okay, so now if you have one sister, so how long is her hair? How long is her hair? Uh, she, she has uh, long hair. Okay, perfect. She has long hair. Uh, Patricia, Patricia, do you have brothers, Patricia Nunez? Yes, I do. I have a, a brother. You have just one brother? Just one. one. Okay, how old is he? Um, uh, he, he is a... Uh, um, uh, me, uh, middle age. Mm -hmm. But listen the question. How old is he? How old is he? Uh, he is 20, he is 30, uh, he is okay. 40. He has a... Uh, he has or he is? He, uh, he is. He ah, is. nice. He, he is, is. Uh -huh. he is a uh, 40... Seven years old. Ah, okay, he is forty-seven years old. Okay, and uh, what is his face like? He he has uh, mm -hmm. um oval oval face and oval perfect. Face. He yes. has oval faced. Okay, nice. Let's see. Okay. Let's see. I have a question now for. I have a question, teacher. Go ahead. In this case, uh, you asked her about the face of their, I don't know, brother, no? His but, brother, uh, her uh, brother. Yes, but uh, the, the question is, what is your face like? Or what is his face like? Yeah, in this we case. to use like or not? Yeah, I'll put it like, because it's like, Como es, right? So that's why I put it, what is his face like, okay? Mm -hmm. What is his face? Because we are talking about his, her brother, right? Her brother. It's so not necessary the, to use like. It's not necessary if I say, okay. what is her face? So we are, we know that I'm asking you about how it is, if it is oval, long, square, okay? But if you put like, it's also correct. Both are correct. Nice. Let's see. I have one more question right here for Lilian. Lilian Galvez. Lilian, uh, do you have uh, children? Yes. Two. Mm. Uh -huh. Try to answer in a correct, in a full weight. Okay. Every time that we ask you a question, we do. You need to answer with do. Do you have children? Yes, I do. I yes. have two children. Okay. Yes. yes, I do. I have two children. Okay. So it is a boy. There are there are boys or there are girls. Boy. Okay. You have two boys. Yes. Okay. You have two boys. Okay. So what color are? Uh, their eyes. Look at the pronouns, okay? Estamos hablando de dos, they, right? How, what color are their eyes? Um, they are uh, color hard is um, they are or they have? They have mm -hmm. a brown. They have uh, brown eyes, okay? Brown they eyes. have brown eyes. Okay, nice. Elvis, 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 okay? Uh, by any chance, let's see. I guess that you have a bust, okay? Um, what is your bust height? What is your bust height? My boss high 
is uh, around the one meter with 60 centimeters. Okay, a it's short. Okay, so in that case, we can say my bus is or he is, right? So my bus mm -hmm. is one meter and 60 something centimeters, right? So that is the correct weight. Nice. Okay. The last one, the last one will be for um, Dagoberto, Dagoberto Rodriguez. So how long is your wife here? How long is your wife here? Dagoberto Rodriguez? Dagoberto, I guess you are on mute. There you go. The question, please. The question is, how long is your wife here? Here. This one. Uh, here, here is our short. short. Okay. Here, here is yes. short. Okay. Yes. Here, here is short. Okay. Una oreja, no. Here, cabello, right here. Okay, okay, okay. Perfect. Ears, here. Nice. Okay, we are going to continue. My goodness. We have just two more minutes. Oh my God. So let's see. Let's see. We have another objective right here. Uh, Noemi, Jesenia, please help us with the reading right here. Okay. Objective. In this session, you will listen to a dialogue where two people use modifiers with participle and prepositions. Thank you. Okay. In this section, you will listen to a dialogue where two people use modifiers with principles and prepositions. Okay. So let's see the conversation that we have in the, in the platform. Okay. So we have just one more minute, okay? We have just one more minute, okay? So to see the next conversation that we have right here. So remember that we are in the lesson number four, okay? Um, I don't know if all of you were here yesterday, but if someone was not here, so I will be with you during this week and the next one, okay? So it's two weeks. And we need to complete the platform activities, okay? So, Si alguien va atrasadito en la plataforma, please escríbanme. Les voy a volver a colocar acá mi número. Yo creo que todos están en el WhatsApp chat, right? But um, that is me, okay? If you need help, if you need assistance, okay, please send me a message and I will be able to help you, okay? So because this is your final score, ok? So aquí no hay una evaluación donde yo lo vaya a reprobar a usted o algo así, ¿verdad? Aquí usted se da su nota por medio del trabajo de la plataforma. So, in the chat, there is right there my name and my phone number, ok? Debemos de ir finalizando la lección 4 en la plataforma. Si usted va ahí por la 1, por la 2, Por casi la tres, por la tres está atrasado. Ok. Usted debe de wow. ir finalizando la lección cuatro. Ok. Y el día, el fin de semana podemos tra tratar de finalizar la lesson number five. And that way, next week, we will do the final quiz together. Ok. So, this is a friendly reminder. Ok, that we need to work in the platform. Si alguien va por ahí como por la unidad 2, está atrasadito. Ok, we need to be um, more than four. We estamos, miren, empezando el 4.5 in the class. But that doesn't mean that we need to be there. So usted en la plataforma, usted debe de ir terminando. Ok, terminando la, uh, la unidad 4. So we are going to stop for a while, okay? So tomorrow we will listen this um, conversation right here that says describing people. And we are going to do different activities tomorrow, okay? Sure. So go ahead, yeah. I have another question. I don't oh. know or I don't remember if 
the are no is there a rule about the order of the uh, platform no 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 they describe people uh, describe hair in this long black hair in this case i don't know it's black long yeah hair there is an order black. we have a, a order mm -hmm. for the adjectives Eso serían adjectives that describe some something or someone there is an order, okay? It's not that you would say it in the way that you want. There is an order for you to put the correct position, right? I have long red hair, okay? So it's not red long, it's long okay. red hair, okay? So I have something right there. Also, I will share with you something about phrasal verbs. Tomorrow we are going to talk about phrasal verbs. And I'm sorry, que ya los estoy develando. Ya me pasé dos minutos, sorry. Okay, but tomorrow uh, we will continue with this conversation. And also I will be sharing in the WhatsApp group. Okay, um, list of phrasal verbs. Okay, so uh, if you don't know what is phrasal verbs, so be here tomorrow because we will talk a little bit about the phrasal verbs, okay? And don't forget your homework. Try to use your phone in English. That will help you a lot, okay? So thank you for your time. Thank, thank you for your participation. And I hope to see you tomorrow, okay? Let's see you tomorrow, the same link, the same time, okay? Enjoy the rest of the night. And thank you so much for your uh, attention. Okay, appreciate it. Bye bye. Thank right, you. Thank you. Bye, bye. bye teacher. Thank you. Thank you. Bye bye. Bye bye. bye, -bye. Mm -hmm.